Get a load of this place, deep divers. Isn't it beautiful? Isn't it lovely? Isn't it gorgeous? Just Gaia doing her thing. Let's go. I said, let's go. You got to do better than that, deep divers. Let's go. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Raising the frequency. Raising the vibration. Take that, take that, take that. Good ass energy I'm sending you. Much love to all of you wonderful deep divers. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. We are out here in the heart of nature and I'm FaceTiming you right now, deep divers. If you are watching this video, this is your confirmation. Every little thing is going to be all right. Shout out to Bob Marley. It's a beautiful day, deep divers. The sun is beaming. It is so hot. The cat down the road passed out. Now, <laughs> first things first. We are living in the greatest times ever. And if you have the eyes to see and the ears to hear, you know what time it is. You know that we are approaching the age of Aquarius where the hidden comes to light. And this is not the time to be sad. This is the time to celebrate. It's not the time to be a bit shaky, baby, because there is nothing, nothing, nothing to be afraid of. We already won. Right? But there is something to be aware of. We got a whole lot to talk about. Watch this video, Deep Divers, before, wait a minute, where did the video go? Before it gets deleted, before it gets taken down, before it just mysteriously disappears into the abyss, because that's what happens on YouTube. Anytime you start speaking that real stuff, videos just disappear. Okay, so watch this. <laughs> now, this is one of the freakiest things we all need to be aware of. We got a lot to talk about. Buckle up, deep divers, because Kansas is going bye-bye. And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? Here to remind you that if it seems like the villains are winning in this story, that's because the story is not over yet. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. And I'm encouraging you to be the hero of your own story, the author of your own story. Reclaim your power, deep divers. Reclaim your freedoms, deep divers. Reclaim your peace of mind, deep divers. And don't let anyone take it away. Now, we are living in a whole new world. That's an understatement. So in 2012, a friend of mine by the name of Aaron Franz gave me a book he wrote called Age of Transitions. And he is a phenomenal mastermind. And it spoke about transhumanism. It spoke about how man is merging with machine and the AI is going to take over. Now, I had a flashback because I'm like, oh my gosh, like everything that's happening right now on the planet was in that book. The age of transitions, right? And we are in the age of transitions. Right now, we are seeing AI, artificial intelligence, really dominating every area of our lives, okay? Have you noticed how many self-service machines there are? It's like, where did all the humans go? One line in the book went like this. One day, humans may be souvenirs. I said, oh my gosh, stop scaring me, Aaron. <laughs> Ralph Smart told you, they want a world without touch, no feeling. A world without smile, no meaning. And this is the reason why over the last few years, they have helped to keep you disconnected from who you really are, disempowered in a state of fear, which is the lowest frequency. And I'm here to remind you, it is time to wake up, people. It is time to wake up. 
and hold on to your humanity over their artificial insanity. This is one of the freakiest things we need to be aware of. You see, the AI, artificial intelligence, is an actual entity and it's alive and it can reproduce. Xenobots, the first living, self-replicating robots. They can have babies. Yes, freaky, right? But have you noticed, Deep Divers, that a lot of people are so infatuated with, they are so infatuated with their iPhone, their, their, <laughs> their gadgets and gizmos, more than human beings. Like more people love their iPhones than they do with, than they do their fellow human being. Like more people spend time on technology than they do with real authentic human beings. Now this is what I call the tipping point because if we keep going, we are gonna lose all trace of humanity. And you gotta remind yourself, the cloud, right? You are uploading to the cloud, you're putting your information on the cloud, you're sharing your information freely, you're giving it away and they are storing this information, Google are. And this is making the AI, the artificial intelligence smarter. So we have to wake up and say, wait a minute, it is time to press pause and realize where we are heading if we don't do something about it. Cryptocurrency, people are like, Ralph, did you invest in Bitcoin? And I'm like, no, I invested in myself. Mm. Slow motion this side, because, mm. you know, cryptocurrency, Bitcoin just crashed, right? And that's why I told you, the same people who gave you the cryptocurrency are the same people who gave you the matrix. You should be investing in yourself. Yes, invest in crypto if you want, but don't place all of your eggs in one basket. Because when it crashes, you're going to be stuck. And when the next economic collapse happens, you don't want to be stuck in some job where you're like, oh my gosh, I don't know what to do. I've lost everything. No, you want to be doing for self. Seven day vegan challenge. You want to be growing your own fruits and vegetables. You want to be coming together with your tribe and realizing that you are all you have. You don't want to be so dependent on this system, so dependent on this matrix because there is gonna be another pandemic and you have to be ready to say, actually, I'm not even, to say, actually, I'm not even worried because I'm chilling with Ralph Smart in 5D, doing a little samba, baby, raising the frequency. This is one of the freakiest things we need to be aware of. People are changing. Their DNA is changing. They're not who they were, 24 months ago. That's why friends and family are leaving you. That's why people are almost like becoming like the inorganic ones. They have become desensitized, disconnected. And this is all about the Borg agenda to turn a human being into a human cyborg. You see, that's what this whole agenda is all about. And they tell you in the films, the series, the episodes like X-Files, they tell you everything that they're gonna do. Predictive programming, that they have technology 100 years from what you're using right now. And the whole goal is that the AI becomes your new God, that you worship the technology over the human being, that you love the technology over the human being, when we should be loving each other more than any technology. Use it, but don't get used by it. This is one of the freakiest things we need to be aware of, that they are replacing you. Human beings, they are replacing you with artificial intelligence. And this is the reason why you have to say, wait a minute, right now, I am no longer going to give my energy to a shabby system. Your government loves you. Your government loves you. Your government loves you. That's the brainwashing that so many people who have been drinking the Jim Jones Kool-Aid believe. But MJ told you, all I really want to say is they don't really care about us. Your government are 
employed by the inorganic ones. And they're beyond what you can see. You can't see them because they live, they live in the spirit realm. We are in the midst of spiritual warfare. That's why there's an agenda to dumb you down. That's why Orwell, 1984, ignorance is strength. War is peace. Freedom is slavery. There's a war going on outside and it's called spiritual warfare. And the only way out is in. You must choose love over fear. Fear sells. That's why a lot of people are drawn to it. But start having an appetite for love. My videos have zero fear in them. Sometimes I do a title that scares you. You're like, oh my gosh, I'm scared. But why did you click on it? Because it shows you. And we've got to remind ourselves, whatever we consume, consumes us. So start starving the ego, feeding the soul, and realize there is nothing to be afraid of. Right now, you have to realize we are at the tipping point. People are changing into something inorganic. And therefore, you have to make sure you are feeling alive every single day. You see, the inorganic ones turn the truth into a lie and the lie into the truth. We're living in the midst of the great inversion. That's why everything is in reverse. When you live in reverse, L-I-V-E, it becomes evil, E-V-I-L. A lot of people do not realize how much they have been lied to. Your government loves you. Listen, remind yourself that this is not how we are supposed to be living, how the majority of people are living. You've been hoodwinked, bamboozled. You're being played like a fiddle while they steal your freedoms. So you have to realize that to win the game, you must become player one and you must become a co-creator of your own reality because they want that by 2030, you own nothing and you're happy. So who owns everything? The AI. In other words, it has all the data of human beings. So it now replaces you. But you don't hear me though. Stay busy. Go to work. Have no time for yourself. Repeat after me. I am free. That's the whole plan. So I want to remind you right now to become aware of what's happening. We are in the age of transitions and you have to hold on to your humanity over the artificial insanity. Because if you do not, human beings will become an ancient relic. But if you do, we will continue to create the new earth. And then just say, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? Hey, beautiful deep divers. Let love guide you, not fear. Woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Go and get the new book, Deep Divers. Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book. Also, the good ass prana shirts at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. They tried to bury us, Deep Divers. They forgot we were seeds. They tried to hide the truth from us, Deep Divers. They tried to hide the truth from us. They forgot that we were the truth. Continue to reclaim your freedom and your power and to unite with your fellow tribesmen and tribeswomen. I love all of you. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. Stay well. Stay healthy. Peace. You hit that like button, deep divers. Share the video. Leave a comment down below of love and appreciation and let me know how this video inspired you and empowered you to continue to live your best life. One love.